Ladies and gentlemen, when you talk about the Hindi film industry and when we talk about our favorite actors, we usually, uh, you know, give them royal nicknames. Like we know who's the Shansha, we know who's the Bacha, and finally in the industry, we have our very own Raj Kumar. And by sheer coincidence, his name is Raj Kumar Rao as well. One of the finest actors we have from the current generation. Hi, Raj Kumar, my dear brother. How are you doing? I'm good, brother. Thank you so much for having me on your show. Thank you, thank you. I'm excited to chat with you. That's why I'm going to go straight into it right now. Okay, so without a doubt, you are one of those actors who always pushes the envelope when it comes to you know your roles, your movies. When a Raj Kumar Rao movie is coming out, we know something special is coming our way. There's no doubt about that. Which is why this brings me to the first question about Badai Do. You read the script for the first time, you heard the narration, and you heard about your character Shardul Thakur. What yeah. made you? What went through your mind? What made you say that? Yar, mujhe ye karna hai. Please take me through that. You know, it was a it was a complete script where it mm -hmm. got a great blend of humor, comedy, entertainment, but also very sensitive in nature, also very emotional in parts, mm -hmm. and also the the messaging, the the thing that the things that it's trying to say are so important, and it's it's the need of the hour that we talk about uh, the problems and we talk about the people uh, from the LGBTQIA community. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. I mean, um, which is wonderful that you said so because that's exactly the next question i'm going to ask you uh when you see the trailer fantastic trailer i'm not saying it because i have to say this i honestly do mean it, it it's you. like a it's like a journey and and you know you really get excited to watch a film like this it's promising a lot of entertainment a lot of humor which is exactly the next question when you treat a topic about the lgbtq community and you talk about homosexuality even i i notice as a secondary topic about uh, parental marital uh, pressure as well. How yeah. do you manage to balance the, the entertainment quotient while talking about all these things that need to be spoken about? Well, the, all the credit should go to our writers, Akshat and Suman and our director, Harsh. It's a, I have no contribution in that. I was only an actor doing my job, sincerely. Right. Uh, but yeah. they have taken almost two and a half, three years to write the script. And it's okay. so well researched and, and they involve people from the community and they made them read the script and took their feedback very seriously so that you know nothing really should go wrong uh, because we know we were making a sensitive film and we do and we didn't want to hurt anyone's sentiments so we were making it, we were making things 100% uh, sure that you know we should make a film that we all are proud of and that's Definitely. exactly what happened yeah mm -hmm. it's a, it's a fine balance of you know as you rightly said it's a fine balance of humor because you know through entertainment we can reach out to many more people out there because people want to come, have fun, and if, if through, in, in between those laughters and, and, and entertainment, if we can also put our point across, you know, we can exactly. make them aware uh, and, and, and educate them a little bit. I think yeah. that's a great combination to have. That sounds like the best plan, obviously. And you didn't do this alone, you had a partner with you. Uh, I think when an opposite actor is another powerhouse of talent, man, you can just expect the kind of scenes you're gonna be expecting in this film. Tell me a little bit more about having that creative sparring session with Bhumi Petnikar, another actress that we all love, yeah, and I'm yeah. sure you do as well. Yeah, I, I love Bhumi. As you rightly said, she's a powerhouse of talent, and she is she is so dedicated, so passionate towards her work. And it's always great to work with you know good actors because it it yeah. helps in your performance. It helps uh, improve you. You really you really feel that you are better at your job when you mm -hmm. work with good actors. And that's exactly what Bhumi did to me. We were complimenting each other. And now, of course, during the filming of the film, we became really good friends. And after the film now, the film is over. It's been almost a year. We're really good buddies. You know, she's somebody I, I talk to almost every day and about random things, not only regarding to our, mm -hmm. regarding our film, yeah. about things in general. So, you know, mm -hmm. it's, uh, I've got a, I got a lifelong friend, <clears throat> lifelong friend in Bhumi and Hirsch, our director. Fantastic. That's so nice to hear. That's so nice to hear. And I'm sure the off-stage or off-screen chemistry is going to be translating beautifully on screen. Speaking about on screen, what a fantastic situation we're in. Finally, films are returning to the cinemas. Now, oh, yeah. I love the OTT. Oh, yeah. I love the OTT platform. Obviously, there's so much wonderful content out there. It's nothing like stepping into a cinema hall and watching something on that big screen, right? So, Raj, oh, yeah. what, tell me, how, how, how exciting is this? How important is it? Do you think that a film like Badai Ho should be watched on the big screen. Tell me more about that. It is. It is meant to be watched on a big screen because it uh, the experience of 
watching a film on big screen is is something you cannot recreate sitting in your living room you know just yeah. to laugh out loud together with hundreds of strangers on on yeah. jokes and and to cry with uh, cry with them it's it's a feeling it's a mm-hmm. it's a memory that you that you create and you remember that memory forever and as a country we love going to theaters we love watching films together and that's been in our blood for for many many decades now mm-hmm. so i'm i'm very happy that a film is coming uh, in theaters uh, mm-hmm. i can't wait to go and watch it with the audiences definitely because that definitely. reaction that instant reaction that you get get where you know hundreds of people are wa- laughing together or they are being yeah. you know sensitive and they're 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 quiet on a very uh, during a very intense scene that's mm-hmm. a feeling that that you get only in theaters and nowhere else absolutely absolutely i i think you hit the nail on the head right there rajkumar well, i'm stoked i'm excited uh, i think the whole world is wherever the film is releasing we are ready to watch this which brings me to the final question that i have for you rajkumar well, this is going to be an interesting one i was um, <clears throat> stalking you for personal reasons not to get worried for personal reasons <laughs> and i i noticed your instagram caption had stated exploring myself in this beautiful film called life Our so life. you're one of those people my friends who is uh, taking finding out more about yourself maybe on a day to day basis so my final question to you my dear brother raj kumar what did you discover about yourself when you were doing a film uh, which is as important as badai do tell me you know i was uh, i was always aware i was uh, like all of us were mm-hmm. are socially aware people you know me mm-hmm. kumi harsh the whole team but after playing this part after playing shardul and living his life on screen mm-hmm. i realized how lonely it can be for someone to to be in that situation where you're where you're hiding your identity hiding your true identity you know where you're not being able to come out in the open because of the societal pressure or the other family yeah. pressure it can be frustrating at time so i think my my heart goes out to people like shardul or to me i wish the world is different and we live in an ideal world world very soon where nobody has to hide their identities and and live their life the way they want to live definitely and definitely and i know many people have taken steps forward to uh, express the lives of these wonderful people and i'm very very sure that badai do is going to play that role as well so final shout out rajkumar anything you want to say to your fans that get them into the cinema halls over to you brother tell us well get ready to laugh out loud together with your friends families and your partners and get ready for a joyful ride and and to to have an wholesome experience with badaido which is releasing on 11th of feb in theaters oh. rajkumar thank you i know we are sitting opposite right now in two different countries but i swear to god my brother when this movie releases i've got a good feeling about it i really hope it sends the message across it becomes a commercial success so when i meet you in person i'll say badai ho badai ho badai thank you so much thank you very thank much you rajkumar all the best to you bro take care Thank you brother take care thank you take care thank you